in from counter just to stop that minion from going down as the first nexus turret is going to fall cuz it's going to go down as well chrono shift back off cooldown like you were saying the cloud drake helping out there but the orn isn't going to be so lucky faker and teddy both still alive as the moonlight vigil comes in double kill now for ruler as he's chasing after faker and teddy teddy gonna go down for the triple as now ruler with the movement speed from this zillion will just destroy faker for the quadra kill hey ho hope you're doing great Gold Rule is going to turn up, but now Root gets into the right position. Oh my god, the kiting out of Ruler's Ash is just disgusting. On Fleek's going to go down. It's going to be Clid that grabs that kill. In fact, make it a double. Take a look at Ruler's Ash here. I mean, Apilios tries to do something, and oh my god. he says 200 years, and Ruler says that, uh, I, I, I don't know what he says, actually. Maybe maybe Ash is secretly Apilios' mother. I, I have no idea. I don't know. The kiting was pretty insane. They're just gonna oh. be able to get out. Okay, cuz full health bar teleport in from T1 as BDD trying to get some more work done. Cuz that's uh, it's Baker, Baker actually who's been back to base. Oh, that was not the one that I was expecting it to be. His bubble connects onto the Ola. BDD looks for it but doesn't find it. Zonya's utilized here. Teleport <laughs> in. This fight is extending so long as Clint goes Rascal. golden and Rascal looks for Baker. Canner into the back line. BDD survives though. As Kana oh. falls down and Rascal gets a huge knockup. Faker still trying to get in amongst it as there's all the knockups and Faker is eventually taken down. Teddy. This hyper extended team fight will eventually go in favor of Gen G with a triple kill from Ruler at the very end. Viper, as we know, held on to everything. Didn't go into his fight, but this is the time. Oh, Crown goes forward. He's got five minutes to stasis, but will it matter? Look at the Wombo from the Vlad, and Toby gets on in there. The Fear takes down two. Crown is too low, but look at Ruler. He's able to take down two, and Kube gets the ultimate on him. Toby disappears, and it looks like Genji may have just done it. Ruler is alive, and may just be the ace, as only Viper is left. Two kills will do it, and Ruler knows it as well. Ruler could keep space through all of the flashy ultimates. They had no threat onto the Guardian Angels. Radiance as it is going to come down. No deaths just yet, but they are coming as swept up is the Jarvan. And you do see the Ezreal here. The ruler having a bit of trouble against Silas. He is a nasty fellow in the mid lane. But sniped by Ruler, just showing off his stuff here in game number one. Yeah, they are. You've got Seth roaming around from the side, but he's not going to get there in time. And the second Drake is just going to go down. There's the Fates Call. Hybrid already down to half, though, and he's hit by the bubble. Showstopper into the front line, but that's to save Clid. As though he's already dead, but Ruler has now been unleashed. True Shot Barrage over three. Clid grabs that kill. Zixu, sure to die next. Unbreakable is going to be put up, but that will wear off as the Q lands from Clint, and they do finish off that team fight. Give it their all here in one last desperate attempt. They're up against the Callista that's on the Baron. I think the Baron steal is off the table. They have to try to go for the actual kills here. As you can see, life is chasing, but Rascal is just gonna die. Into the back line goes the Kai'Sa, and the steal on the Baron at the same time. Can Genji actually win the fight? You see Ruler with so much room, and he's gonna get a triple kill already, and the kill is gonna go down onto the Jason somehow. Now, with the quadra kill, somehow Gen G have turned this game around. Wait, they have a minion wave! And they, they have they a minion wave. Maker. They're gonna try to end the game, absolutely. No, Pink no, to kill. No. Pink oh, to kill. As we go back to live, this is Gen G breaking over the bottom side of yep, the base. We're gonna have one last stand. Yep, Death Charge going to come through here from Fate. True Shot oh, Barrage is going to no. make sure that he dies. The last auto attack from Ruler is enough to lock that one down. As now Rascal, he's going to QSS. The double kill comes in from the Ezreal as the final chapter does nothing, but it doesn't need to. Gen yeah. G will get rid of the last. Nexus turret and Ruler is able to just get over the top of this team. Lonely goes golden, but he's oh, not the Penta. golden boy at this stage. As that's the pentakill. Ruler is going to say no, it is not yours. Lands a couple oh of Qs. There's another one God. on the Keep. That had a hit. If that True Shot Barrage had a hit, that was a very dead threat. Oh. Now Sangin's looking to go into Cataclysm to come down Hanwha. One last team fight to rule them all. Can they make it work? Fly says no. As he dives into the back line, it's basically an instant. Oh, Triple oh, kill. Oh. Make
takes out a quadrant. Fly comes oh. down. Stolen no and denied no is Roach. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> 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 I think he almost called him an F and B word, really. Again and again, we have seen the same thing. The lack of vision, we're going to see it another time. Well, Trick looking to give Crown his ninth death, and he is going to be able to do so. Ruler in a bit of trouble, as there's the Solar Flare right on top. QSS already down. The Ghost is able to grab that kill. Trick still alive. Cube looking to try and gra grab the pick, and Ghost once again going to fall down. And now, are we going to have the Ruler show? Tempt taking so much damage. He's just going to go in, and Zonya's wanting to get on top of Ruler, but he's at full health. Just wanders through now, happy to use the rocket jump to get the work done. Searing charge, but the Goomba is stomped down on triple kill for the Tristana. And Damwon Kia will win the fight two to one. But is it over just yet? Canyon's burning. Primal Surge is running. Ruler! Right Ruler, oh my god, dives on forward. But it's not quite enough. Going golden is BDD, but Ghost is going to pop him on the back. Oh, the red buff! Not that, enough. We knew that this team, they, they are very skilled. They have the ability. It's just the question of can they do it on the day as here we go. The hook comes in. They immediately take out BDD and not much of a follow-up. Nice snipe there from Ruler. He's looking for death, gets the two, but Jovi is just so strong right now. Takes the turret shot. In goes Rascal, though. They're gonna take down Jovi. They might be able to stop the offense oh. coming in from DRX as Ghost oh. goes quadra? on as he will go down. That's the Quadra. And Ruler says, I'm not gonna go down without a fight. I don't care how my team is gonna do. They're looking for this Penta kill. Oh. Should eventually be able to oh. Finally comes in Ruler. Damaki needs to show us why it was ignored here in the draft in game at number three. That first Nexus turret is going to go down. The little boot comes out from Cleeter. Doesn't have a lot of mana, but the Kaiser is just destroyed. The knock up onto Showmaker as well. Sagago Stoneplate makes Rascal nigh unkillable. A double kill for the Jinx now as she's getting excited. A beautiful hook from life here as well as Jinx grabs a triple. Could it be the Penter as the Quadra kill? G Way, they read the tortoise in the hair, like the rest of us, and they took it to heart. This should be the last Nexus Tower as Flash. Oh, where'd he go? He tried the portal jump, but he gets pulled in anyway. Down will go key, and that should be able to do it. Down goes the cannon, and as the clock strikes 12, Genji finally are going to be able to take game number three. They want more kills. They're not ready to go with this one just yet. They want to take out someone here, and that they will. The pedicle and the death over to Ruler. The other thing you have to watch is the shockwave. Yep. Watch that ball. Eye on the ball, eye on the prize. They get a TP in for Broken Blade. He wants this one. He's not going to burn the ult. He accepts to go away, but they're still they can it early. The here Can get the easy pickup. Should what? be an easy smite. What? And he's going to try. Gonna... You got to be kidding me. He smited the heal, as you said, Kobe. And Ruler finds the kill. Not able to get the kill. Maybe Prince can do it? Can anyone kill this guy? The rocket comes in and actually gets him. Threads the needle. He's building that, and here comes the push with the Baron down on the bottom side, and Baker immediately is just gonna basically die. He gets sniped out by Ruler. See you later. Ali now picking up that minion wave as Ruler's dashing forward, looking for it. There's the Gravitum stun. Repost's on cooldown. Ali might just get soloed out by Ruler. The Grand Challenge comes in, but Ruler accepts it and says you're dead. The shutdown delivered to Bertle. Yes, you get the Mountain Soul, but how is Jinji getting the Baron. a Baron this game? Namsik not in a position to fight. Oh, the Islamic Force of Cast does not do much, so the ults are down. Here comes the re against once again for Ambition. Wants to add the damage. Oh, now. look at the blade, Colorado Ruler. Do they have the oh, red? Oh, God. Oh, Triple knockup. The follow through for Cuban. And he's going to fight for help, but still one death comes through. The suppression comes in. Four kills already. One man stands alive, and he's going to fall. A championship winning pick for Ruler. That might be the Flash R. That signals the end of the SKT Dynasty. Full jab, you can force very, very hard. Well, Ali's immediately in there. Awandi as well, beautiful charm. Bullet time's going to secure it onto BDD. That's so much of their damage now missing. The Lulu just gets obliterated, but Ruler dashing on forward. Ali's going to get shut down. It's a double kill for the world champion AD carry on the bottom side for Gen Jeeps. Well, the light will pop back. Nice shock, but this time they're trying to take out BDD, but they can't actually get the last kill. Finally, the axe comes through, and Olaf gets the big shutdown. But still, a lot of other tools here trying to extend way deep into the base of Fred and Brion. They're not actually able to get any kills. Finally, they find the engage they're looking for, and that's going to be the triple kill. Make it the Quadra. 
Will it be a Penta? Can Do they it. set up for the Penta? They're gonna try to get it. The Penta will come in. I don't know if that's the right way to go. They're trying to group though. Oh, why? He went in. Dead. He's gonna get taunted. There's that mistake. Here they go. Into the back line, but Tarzan immediately dies. It's the damage there for Griffin. It's another question. Oh. Look at how much damage Fate does. What the hell is going on? They turn it around on the that's target. One. The ruler is still alive in the back line. Unbelievable. He's flashing ball. He got him. He kills Toby. He's looking for more. And she's going to go on to Viper here. Down goes the triple. There's the Quadra. And it looks like Gen G are going to win game one. Ruler's done it on the vein. He managed it against the car. That was so tricky to do. And the third defeat of the season in just best of ones is inflicted by Gen G.